Hi guys, I just wanted to do a quick little haul video for you guys. Uh, this past weekend I went to Little Tokyo and um, I got a lot of cute little things here. Um, so, let's see, I went to the Sanrio shop that they had and I just got, um, where is it? Let me dig through my bag here. Oh, let me just dump everything out. Here you go. Okay, so I got this really cute pom pom pudding um, little plushie that reminds me of a lot of a Tsum Tsum, and I thought it was so cute. He was the last pom pom pudding, and here, like really soft material, very cute, and he has beans in his butt so he can stand on his own. And I thought it was just gonna be really cute. Then I'm gonna keep him in my office. And um, they also had a really cute, um, what, what is it, those coin imprint machines. Um, and it was uh, Hello Kitty Sakura themed. And these were so cute, I couldn't pass it up. Usually I find these machines at uh, amusement parks, but they had one um, in the Sanrio shop, and it was a pretty good price too. It was only 50 cents uh, plus one penny to imprint and usually at the amusement parks, they, like, they charge like a dollar or like 75 cents or something like that for a penny imprint. But I thought this was really pretty. So here is Hello Kitty in a kimono with an umbrella. So pretty. And um, I also got, uh, let's see, these really cute, I, uh, whenever I'm in uh, Little Tokyo, I'm, I'm always trying to find um, uh, card captor Sakura goods. So, let me show you some of these really cute straps, these rubber straps. I'm not going to even take them out of the packaging because um, rubber straps usually are, they get dirty really easily. Um, so I have a few on my, my keys, and of course my keys are dirty, so the, uh, my rubber um, straps tend to get really dirty really easily. So, um, this I got at Kuni, um, Kino Kuniya Bookstore. And I was about to leave the store, but then I saw a little little area of the store that I didn't even see. And then I started looking around, and I saw a lot of these rubber uh, rubber straps. And they have card capture stuff themed. I guess um, this is like a maid cafe or pastry cafe. And it's so cute. I love Kudo's design. So I got. They also had two straps uh, for Toya and. And Yuki and so um, I didn't get those I just wanted to get these because as you can see right here just for true straps they're kind of on the pricey side they were what $12.99 so it racked up pretty pretty quickly so I got these and um, now the, this was I already opened it up but this was uh, in another area um, or like it was in the uh, 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 so these were hanging off of one area and then I turned around, and then there were these like these blind, um, blind packages, and all it said in writing was "Cardcaptor Sakura," um, like acrylic charms, uh, and they didn't even have like any kind of image as to what it was. So I just bought it blindly, and I was hoping. I mean, we like it, it, all it said was it was an acrylic um, keychain, so I didn't know what it was. But for eight ninety nine, I'm like. Uh, it's kind of pricey, but I was very, very curious as to what it was. And when I got it, this is what how it was wrapped in, wrapped very securely. And it's just an acrylic charm of the same rubber, uh, rubber, um, the same rubber uh, keychain strap. So this one though is a little bit more sturdy since it is acrylic. So I'm probably gonna put this on my wallet or. My keys, very cute, and it comes with a gold ball keychain. So I got that. Oh, and I also got this as well. Um, this nano block uh, parakeet set, and I thought it was really, really cute. And for the price, it was cheaper than the others. Um, I saw some more convoluted ones. They didn't have a, a great selection, but they had a fair few and. Um, some of the pricier uh, selections was like these Hello Kitty, um, like really convoluted kind of place uh, nano block sets, um, which was like 
triple or quadruple the price of this one. This one is probably their cheapest that they had available. And also it's a level one, which I thought it was um, pretty appropriate because I never put together a nano block set before. And I thought it, was, it would be really cute. Yep, and I'll probably do a separate video on me putting this together. And then for the last item is this Sumiko Gurashi Remint um, Summer Desserts or Summer Summer Festival Foods. What was it called? Local Gourmet. Okay, so it's Local Gourmet Remint Keychains. Um, I haven't opened it up yet, so I don't know which one I am going to get. What I would really want is any of these three right here. So I really like the tempura rice ball or the melon soft um, ice cream or this um, kaki noha sushi. I don't even know what that is. And at first I thought this was gyoza, but it's um, sweet fish cake. And then this side, um, let's see, this is shomai um, shaved ice. Th this is really cute too. And this takoyaki, I love takoyaki. And this one is Zunda Mochi, which I don't really know what that is. Okay, so let's go ahead and open it up and see what I got. And I got the sushi. Wow, it's actually bigger than I thought it was gonna be. And I don't have scissors with me. Can I open it up through the hole? I probably could, let me see here. here. This is a lot bigger keychain than I thought it was going to be. Like, I've opened these remnants before for Sumiko Gorashi and I think this one's, this one's actually pretty big and heavy too. Or has a good weight to it. So here is the Polar Bear Sushi. And what was it called again? It was a... Um, let's see here. It is a Kaki Noha Sushi. I'm going to have to look that up to see what, what that is. So it's really cute though. And it comes with a ball chain as well. So that is it guys. I uh, hope you like my little haul video and I will see you in the next one. Bye.